This method does not require GitHub or Unity Cloud, and even though they are useful, sometimes it's an overkill when you just need to send your project real quick. Alright, so you see my RPG project size is about 2 gigabytes, and if I try to download it by the link, it's only 9 megabytes. The difference is significant, and I'm gonna show you how to achieve this in this video. Just be sure to watch this video till the end, because there are a couple of important steps that you must know about to make it work. First, you need to make a zip archive of your project. You can do it using WinRAR. If you don't have it, you can download it by the link I will attach below. So once you got it, you need to click right button on your project, choose WinRAR and then add to archive. And then you need to be sure you're making a zip archive. You can do that by clicking dot zip over here. Then you simply click OK button. This may take a couple of minutes to finish, so while you're waiting, I wanna share some very useful information. I have a very comprehensive RPG course for those who want to learn more about game development. It has tens of thousands of students that are already making their own video games. And you can join them by clicking the link in the description below. Now, once creation of archive is finished and you open it, you will see a license window that you can simply ignore, well, unless you want to support creators of the software. Then you need to go ahead and find library folder. This folder basically contains cache and data files that Unity needs to make everything work. And as you can see, it takes most of the space in the project. The good thing is, if you delete it, Unity will download those files when you try to open your project next time. That means it is completely safe to delete this folder before you send your project. And if you're afraid it will break something in your game, don't worry, you have original project here and project you're modifying is in this archive. So you are good in any case. Now very important disclaimer, hear me out. When you just open the project after this, it may look empty. Don't panic, you did not delete anything important. You just go to scene and open sample scene that you had. And then you're gonna use your project same as before. Now you need to open your Google Drive and upload your newly created archive. Once it is uploaded, you click these three dots and then choose share and copy link. And now comes the step I was talking about, so please pay attention. In the corner, you will have a pop-up window. You need to click it and you need to make sure you make it available for anyone with the link. Otherwise, people will have to request access to your file and you will need to grant access in your Gmail, which is very annoying for both sides. Now you can easily send your links and don't forget to check link to the RPG course in the description below. If you found this info useful, consider subscribing to the channel. And I want to say thanks to my Patreons and give special thanks to Siramo89 and Gianni Maroni. Thanks to you guys, these videos are possible.